I told one of the doctors, this must be like how the astronauts feel <laughs> when they're in space. <laughs> and I was the first candidate to use the machine. Um, I'm just kind of excited on being on the cutting edge of something and just so thankful uh, to receive treatment for the brain tumor. With the Zapex, I'm really excited about treating patients and having them go back to their normal lives with minimal side effects. The Zapex produces multiple small photon beams that when directed at a tumor can disrupt the DNA of a tumor and result in the tumor's death. I was scheduled for five treatments, but after three treatments, they were very pleased with the results, and so I didn't have to have the additional two. So it all worked out very well for me. <laughs> in 2006, I had breast cancer, and then I was a 14-year survivor. And then in August of 2020, the cancer in my breast had metastasized to my brain. Surgery was performed by Dr. Anazi at MedStar Georgetown Hospital, and it was very successful. They wanted to follow up with radiation to kill any cancer cells that may have remained after the surgery. Then I went to the MedStar Georgetown Cancer Institute at MedStar Southern Maryland Hospital Center. At that time, I was told that I was the first on the East Coast to receive the treatments with the new Zapex. So I was excited. I, I just, in fact, I, I was almost like, wow, me? <laughs> you know, it was almost unbelievable but very, very thankful. It was God's timing, and I just felt like I was in the best hands. As cancer therapies improve, patients are living longer and longer with metastatic cancer. So for her case, we used the Zapex in order to minimize the toxicity from her treatment, because we expect her to have a long survival. I'm looking for full recovery. I have a great team of doctors. I just figure each day that God gives me, it's a blessing and I'm gonna make the best of it.